Hello, my name is Coach Mack. Now we're going to learn the Sitra. <laughs> okay. Um, first thing I teach the kid, if uh, they're just starting to learn the Sitra, is uh, I have them sit like this, with straight legs, and I have them put their hands right by their side, and then have them push like this. They can bounce a little bit, and then once they're comfortable with that, I stand right next to them, right here, and I double bounce them. To, so that they can stand up. Except I didn't, I didn't double bounce it with anybody at that time. So I double bounce them and I catch their, their arm like that. Next thing is uh, I would have them on a mat, on a thin mat, and I would have them bend their legs, and like this, and I just kick out the legs. Real simple. Bend, kick. And then once they're done with that, once they're comfortable, they can circle their arms a little bit and bounce. And that is the seat drop. Now we're going to learn the back drop. <laughs> so the first thing I have people do is uh, have them go on their back and just bounce up and down. I usually have, I'll stand right next to them while they're on their back and hold their ankles like this, maybe a wrist, and I'll just have to bounce up and down like this. So they'll be in this position. So they'll be bouncing up and down like this. While I grab their wrists and their ankles. And once they're comfortable with that, I have them stand up here like this. And I have them kick their legs up. I can spot the wrist and the legs coming up. I would usually tap the shins as they go over so they don't over rotate. So it's here, they can bend their legs and take So bend their legs. That's how I start with that. Then once they feel comfortable with that, they can start bouncing. Hello, I'm Coach Mack. Today we're going to learn the front drop. Okay, first thing I go over with kids is uh, I have them well, go on their stomach and have them in this position. Make sure their hands are in front of their face to protect their face so they get used to that. Then I have them go on doggy position. Then down to belly like this. Multiple times until they feel comfortable. Then after that, if they're comfortable with that, they're going to start like this, bent legs, and push back. Usually I have a mat underneath them. And as they feel more comfortable, they can stand up higher and higher, or taller. And if you bounce, 